Hello, hello. Here we are yet again. In the popular life. Happy, 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 happy popular life. <laughs> Yo, happy Friday. Welcome back. Um, microphone is actually properly working again. At least it looks like this. Um, it's early in the morning. Doing our first walk of the day and today it's been quite chill so it's it's great um so for today quite an unusual topic for friday while everybody opens their windows and hopes the new air comes in after lots of heat hotness and such which i don't hope it's gonna stop anytime soon but i hope by next week we will be a bit better off. Um, anyways, for today, um, how about talking about the work? There is something on your plate that you know needs doing. And the, the topic for today is the work that needs doing. I first heard about this on a podcast by Alex Hormozzi, where he would say um, this continuously, and he kept saying that throughout other podcasts as well, um, which is the work needs doing. So there is something on your plate that you know you need to do, and for somehow you're procrastinating and somehow you're pushing it away, um, actually just convincing yourself that the fulfillment that you can feel is the fulfillment of the right now and right here right now and avoiding to do that in order for you to do something else which might just be a bit more um fulfilling in in the short term for you right um whereas you're ignoring the other side of it which is the fact that once you start acting on those things they actually also become fulfilling not just because you see results because that, that of course as we know takes time but because you see that the compounding clock has started and there is a self-fulfillment uh, process self-fulfillment magic somehow once you start uh, realizing and you start actually doing the thing that you need to do which i'm sure you know and it might just not be one it might just be two three depending on the areas of your life but you know you need to do them and that it will take time for you to see results. But guess what? If you never start, results never come. And so there is nothing there is nothing romantic about it. Um, and it's, it's, I, I'm thinking also about Gary Vee, who also says, um, it's not that I don't believe in manifesting. I, I'm a big believer in you know spirituality and spiritual power of, of things. The thing that I don't like is that uh, we think about writing something on a mirror and then hopefully that becomes true. And well, it's not true. Um, he says I'm a bigger fan of actually doing the thing rather than just uh, designing it somehow, right? Uh, and, and it's kind of the same thing where uh, Hormozzi would say the work needs doing. And he also asked a question, which I think is, is fairly interesting and inspiring, which is when will you start the compounding block? If you start today, it's very different than if you start tomorrow. And trust me, mom has many things um, also regarding me that felt like maybe she would have started sooner. It would have been better, which everybody has in her life. Um, So if you have one, there should be enough for you to understand that there is no way for you to be avoiding that thing. And mom is also living something like that as well at the same time. Um, but is trying to avoid as much as she can to just keep going on this on on this path, right? And this translates in companies very very well. Usually, uh, we said every startup problem is a is a talent problem, but usually <clears throat> there is uh, there is one single thing that you know is the thing that is running your startup, that is pushing your company forward, that is actually building up um, your your thing um, and that needs to be doing and it needs to be kept doing all the freaking time. Um, do you do it? Yes. Do you do it? Maybe no. Do you do it enough? Um, maybe I would say 
most part of the people don't do it. That's also what Gary Vee says. And then the reason why he gives up, gives out content for free. And that's also a reason why um, curses to become rich, entrepreneurial, um, independent, free, or whatever that w- might mean mm, are just a, such a big hit um, in, in life and in the market because it's actually easier to sell the fact that you can learn the key to unlock it, the, the key to success, the secret, blah, 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 rather than actually doing the actual work that is needed. And so if this couple of days you are thinking about what's in there again, what do I need to do? What shall I do? What can be done better? Trust me, you know. And I'm a dog, but I know you know. And unfortunately, the work needs doing. There is no giving it away. There is no delegation, especially in the first stages. There is a bit of control to be done, for sure. And um, sure, it's not romantic, but it is what it is. Sometimes we, and on a more hopeful note, sometimes it's just, it is what it is. And... um, Yep, so we're now going to go to the work that it's doing. I hope you're going to go too. And now we're going to talk next week on Monday at the same time. And um, and just drop the excuses, drop the whatever. It looks better on you <laughs> than anything else. Um, I will send you... As always, kisses, hugs, and a bit of barks. Follow us on social, me and mom, and uh, we will talk to you on Monday. Bye!